piano, catfish, lamp, keyboard, canteen. How many of those can you remember? If I gathered all your responses, people would usually remember the first word, piano, but it gets harder and harder to hold on to each subsequent word. This is due to primacy effects. The primacy effect states that people, on average, are more likely to remember the first items presented to them than items in the middle of a list. We remember the first items because we place them successfully in our long-term memory. You're more likely to remember things at the beginning and end of a list, so how can we use this quirk of human memory and apply it to our UX work? The best way to account for the effects of primacy is to avoid them entirely. Let's consider three examples for how to apply this to your designs. First, don't ask your users to remember pieces of information if you can avoid it. Second, keep key information visible. And third, in audio or visual mediums, reiterate key information multiple times. For example, if you're designing an e-commerce listing page, carefully consider the first item you present. Items in that location will be selected and remembered more frequently. Additionally, place the least important filters in the middle of your list of available options. These items tend to be stored less frequently, in long-term and working memory, and will be forgotten. In your designs, any written content should state the most important information first. If you must list things, place your most important item at the top of the list. Any information presented in audio or video form is particularly susceptible to primacy effects. So make sure to repeat and emphasize important information clearly and often. The human mind is a fickle thing, but better for us to work alongside its limitations than fight against them. Thanks for watching. If you want to see more of our UX videos, take a look at these over here and consider subscribing to our channel. On our website, enengroup.com, you can access our free library of over 2,000 articles. You can also register for one of our virtual UX conferences that offer live, hands-on UX training.